Hi, and a happy new year for 2022. My name is Daniel, I'm product manager for PRTG, and in this video, I will give you an update on the development of PRTG and our roadmap. 2021, what a year. We had so many things going on. So you might have missed something, but don't worry, I will wrap up the last couple of months for you to get you up to date. Brand new PRTG UI. Have you updated PRTG? With the update from early December, we feature a preview of a brand new user interface for PRTG. It's an alpha version, so the feature set is still limited. We are really excited to bring a whole new user experience to PRTG and show it to you very early on. To activate it, just go to the PRTG web interface, open the setup page and select the option Activate new UI and new API. Feel free to try this feature already today and please don't forget to tell us what you think about it. New RESTful API. Yes, you heard right. When activating the new user interface, you will also get access to an alpha version of our new PRTG API. It is a real RESTful API and follows the guidelines of the REST architecture and enables interactions with all RESTful web services. Based on open API specifications, you will have many new possibilities to automate your monitoring and to integrate other tools as well. Already a bit much to follow? I feel you. That's why our colleague Sasha wrote a few blog articles with all the details you need. We will link them for you below this video. Multi-platform probe. Many of you have asked us to extend our monitoring functionality to non-Windows-based platforms for years. We have good news. There is an early alpha version of our brand new multi-platform probe available and you can try it out with the latest PRTG version. This will make it possible to install a probe on Linux systems like Ubuntu, Debian and CentOS as well as on Docker or on Windows. With later releases, we will also look into possibilities for single board computers like Raspberry Pi and other ARM-based devices. You want to be part of our multi-platform journey? Right. The best way to start is with the tutorial content in our knowledge base. We will link this below this video and there you will also find a survey where you can leave your ideas. Roadmap Update 2022. That's not nearly all we're working on right now. We've also got a lot more cool new features planned for PRTG and 22. To show you our topics this year and beyond, we updated the roadmap on our website to provide you with an overview. Maybe you have a look at it right after this video and see what's in it for you. Speaking of the roadmap, if you find something you like and it has a small S on it, that means that there is a quick survey included. Your feedback is important to shape our development and we highly appreciate if you would take some minutes to do them. PRTG Hosted Monitor. To start 22 right, we got one more thing for you. It all started in 2017 when we took our first steps towards providing our beloved IT monitoring solution as an AWS cloud-hosted version. We started with a basic monthly subscription, offered only one hosting region and received great feedback from growing customer base over the years. If you followed the path of PRTG Hosted Monitor, you might already have seen some small changes like the addition of a new region and the increase of license size up to 10,000 sensors. That happened in preparation for one major change in 22. In order to present PRTG Hosted Monitor to a bigger audience, we decided to expand our offering by adding several new hosting regions for an enhanced global coverage and better ping times. This also includes various features and optimizations that our users ask for, like Pesla update service, full partner support for resellers, more subscription options for hosted licenses, additional payment options, upload your custom MIB files, and much more. Want to know everything about PRTG Hosted Monitor? Read the blog article from our colleague Sasha that we will link below. Want to try it yourself? 
we offer a free 10 days trial on our website that is ready to start within only minutes. That's it from me. If you have any further questions about PRTG and its future development, please leave them in the comment section below and I'm happy to answer them. Thanks for watching, see you next time.